So Go High Level just launched their new uh, AI Agent Studio. And this is a completely game changer, especially when this gets finished. Uh, and the reason why I say that is because this start node, depending on how you want to start. And I feel like what they're really building here is people are saying N8N uh, destroyers and going to be getting rid of a lot of these other tools out there, which I truly believe they're going to do. I mean, you see right here on the left side, MCPs, API calls. Uh, you can even do an AI agent that has a knowledge base or even searching the web. So there's so much here. I want to just show how I would use this for like cleaning businesses uh, use case wise because one, I'm always looking for new ways to improve and especially because like dev teams uh, are so expensive nowadays and we're actually building a software uh, that's going to be able to connect with Go High Level, complete game changer that I'm going to be launching and uh, sharing soon, but it's going to be a complementary to this. But what, I'm, what we're seeing now is the ability to build things no code and with the expansion of like tech AI, um, it's going to be such a game changer for people to really run businesses with a low cost. So a few things I want to show you guys here. You can literally add an AI agent here. And again, there has to be a start node. And I, I believe they're going to launch that. I was looking at some things that they were uh, putting out there. But you can you can add AI tool. You can go ahead, go in, prompt it. You can do the different models, uh, variables here. So this is just one of those, again, ways to be able to uh, start prompting this, building out a knowledge base. And then again, you can dra drag that, a search knowledge base, so there it starts searching all these websites, FAQs, products, places. You can start building those prompts and then uh, web search as well. Yeah, so this is, again, a really great start. And then right here, you can actually start testing your bot. Just to start building this and what they're uh, really launching and creating, it's giving us so many different uh, ideas. One of those ideas that I see, and it's so simple, but it's a bigger idea that I'm gonna be showing you guys here in this video of like what I have, that's gonna be good uh, for cleaning businesses. If you actually go to postal code, so for example, let's say that a client, they fill out, uh, they actually show you what postal codes or zip codes that they service, right? Service areas, because we're helping local cleaning businesses. We have a survey and we use surveys instead of forms for our clients. Uh, there's a lot of reasons why we do that. But at the very end, the last thing is, what if they're not in your service area? What if you can build an agentic workflow or some type of conversational AI where it says, hey, I apologize, we don't service your area. And it can either text them, let them know, or it can stop them right here. And there could be so many routes we can go. I know Go High Level has a specific automation to like say, especially because we're doing surveys, where we could put, uh, if they do put a specific code, postal code or zip code, that it won't allow it. But what if there's like an AI way to do this so it's just more uh, sufficient? And we're trying to go into like the quizzes. So hopefully you guys are tracking with me, but I'm giving you guys an idea of a use case because most clients, what they don't want, um, especially like for example, if you wanna be a potential client for a cleaning business, they don't always wanna get sold on a phone call. So if we were able to find ways to build this a whole workspace out this customer or lead journey i think it'd be like a complete game changer so let me go, let me show you guys um what i'm talking about so again going back here this start node right here i can only imagine them and i think i saw it uh, but they had like an ai workflow where you can start adding a trigger and this would be the start to connecting it to this ai agent uh, builder again Totally game changer with what they're uh, building here and what's possible. And then I also have clients that want to learn more about like uh, generating uh, content and they're not really great at that. But look at this audio generation, image generation, video generation, text generation. So I can only imagine what type of workflows you can start building to even be like an agency that helps uh, with social media for your clients, especially in the cleaning business space. They just want to continue to post add creatives and most of the business owners, they're not creative people or they don't want to be social media creative people. They just want to be owners, operators. So yeah, a lot of things that we see as they're launching it and uh, they're growing it. But I want to show you guys, this gave me hope on like how close they are to building what we've been looking for. And what that looks like is, this is a company, I'm not going to show the exact company, but they have a quiz and I know they built this off code. Once you fill out your information, you, it's, it starts asking what type of clean are you looking for? And again, you can build this off high level on the surveys, but it's not as AI software code base generative yet. That's why when I saw what they launched with this uh, agent studio, 
I knew it was going to be the next level to doing this for clients. And so many people are going to be able to help a lot more businesses with this, especially in the cleaning space. So for example, you can just switch whatever, whichever one. Uh, I need some extra hands for a quick tidy make bed. So this is kind of like a standard clean. So I hit that. Let's say it's two beds, two baths. Uh, hit OK. And then how clean is it? So this is kind of like the dirt code, right? If you guys don't know dirt code, cleaning businesses, they know dirt code. Dirty, cl right? Whichever one, let's just say we put a little messy. So I'll put that there. And again, think about this from like elite's perspective, someone that needs home cleaning. Uh, do you have pets or kids? Let's say you say yes, yes. So it again, puts it into consideration. And then this is just a random uh, address that I was I was putting. This is like restaurants because they're this company's in Texas. But let's just say I put this one, I put this address, and this is so cool, right? This is kind of like what AI can start to, to really look into a database and say, hey, you know what? We don't service this area. And it says, sorry, we don't currently service this area. So these are quizzes that we want to be able to build, okay? And check this out. Let's say it is in your service area. Because I think leads and customers, ideal customers for, for businesses, not everyone wants to get sold on a phone call. Some want a simple experience and they just want to pick and choose. And then based on what they pick and choose, we either dial in, get them on one last call just to finalize a few things. They don't want to get upsold. Or we say, okay, that's great. Go ahead and book with us. And then we just say, thank you for choosing us. So I hit this. A lot of marketing strategies and tactics there, like the get 20 the percent off. So the clean type how many hours, uh, what's included. This is so great. You can see if you add a payment method, six, 16%. Again, these are all like conversion methods all through a quiz funnel. So imagine if you can build a quiz through Go High Level, and I believe we can do this and we're really close to doing that. Uh, no code, without code. I, I, I believe that they actually built this off JavaScript. I, I looked up their website. So clean details, you can see all this. Oh, it actually brought me back to that page. Pets, kids, I'm a little messy. And then if you look, look, it populates a price. And then it also shows the price that uh, would originally be. And then if you book now. Again, a lot of psychology with marketing and sales. But let's say in, inside fridge, it adds that inside oven. So I'm sure every cleaning business has different, uh, you could say, pricing depending on these extras. I think these are a little bit more like just an oven it adds an additional, how much is that? An additional almost 100 bucks for just an oven. Again, I think these are just things that can be done if promptly, if, if the prompts and the knowledge base are correctly adjusted, we could be able to build these in a studio. And then from there, you choose a time and then boom, it's an automatic online booking. I think the quiz format is actually gonna be it the thing that a lot of cleaning businesses are gonna adapt to um, just because just because of the fact that, and look, I'm looking at this AI agents as what could be done, the knowledge base. But I think a, a lot of these cleaning uh, businesses are gonna be able to run off these quizzes because of the experience, how quick it is, how fun it is to be able to go through this, especially for from a leads perspective. Quizzes have always worked for all types of industries. Now that we can use it with like no code tools, I think it is uh, a new era. And I, I believe we can start doing that on go high level. So I see that as like the next level of where a lot of businesses are gonna go. And we're gonna split test this with our clients once I can build something out on the quiz side. I actually built this. So this is like a website that I built off Bolt. If you guys haven't seen my video, I'm building like this quote form on Bolt. So let's say like I just did this, okay. It automatically drives a quote. So again, it's the same exact uh, things that are asked. Okay, no, and then it automatically populates a quote. So after I fill out this information, it will automatically pop out a quote for me. So let me just put RC, let me just put a random number for you guys, rc at test.com. Okay, agree, get my quote. And then boom, it gives you a quote. But this is just a standard. So this is something that Again, there's a lot of companies that have built this, but imagine if you could do this and specialize it as a cleaning uh, agency and then help an actual cleaning business and optimize it. Because I look at a lot of these booking forms and they're not as optimized or you have you have this or that and they're not as customizable, right, to the specific cleaning business. So I think this is just gonna be a big game changer again, this agentic workflow. 
and then just seeing how you could do that with it with that another use case that i would see is if i go back i'm just going to save that and then what a lot of companies in the cleaning business space what they end up doing is if you go to uh, payments they, they actually use invoices recurring invoices and then we we send documents so they'll send like the client policies and just contracts and documents over once they become booked um, so once you we put them into the book category tagged on go high level we can do agentic workflows that uh, would be able to help with these and maybe even come up with the custom invoices and estimates to send them based on what they put through the survey or the quiz that we uh, built and then also send up follow up so there's a whole workflow here that a lot of business owners are going to like i'm just kind of giving you guys a few of the use cases that i would see and to be able to get here is just ai agents agent studio and then boom back in here but these are a lot of the cleaning business um, use cases because whenever i look at workflows automations i look at the real life use cases and i think a big part of this is going to be the automatic instant quotes that are going to be able to generate through go high level the crm follow-ups, nurture sequences, track everything, um, that whole quote system and the postal code and saying, hey, we can't serve you. And then going into the invoicing, the contracts, I think a lot of our clients have been asking about that. So this is so exciting. Um, stay tuned for more. I'll be able to show you guys. Hope to see you in another video. If you want to work with us, you have questions, I'll drop some info below and I'll just drop a few other trainings that you guys can check out in the cleaning space. I have a lot of great playlists. So God bless you. See you in the next video. Bye-bye.